Good morning, folks. Welcome back to Seven Days to Die. We got a new toy. Our SMG level six is done. She's so pretty. Got her modded up really nice. Um, let's see. Got the silencer mod, the rad remover, foregrip, and a drum mag. So should do pretty nice. Should sing really well for us, hopefully. Let's get our bike out here. Um, get our fuel back up. We're going to head out. What are we going to do today? What is 5.8 kilometers away that I marked? I don't even know now. I don't remember. I'm going to head over there and find out. I think we were going to try to work on some more tier fives today. Oh, what I need three more cops uh, to try to finish off that quest. I'd like to see if we can get a few more of the tier fives done before the day 35 horde. And then I think we're going to call that good there. Um, yeah, so that's the plan. I will see you over there in just a few minutes. So I decided against my better and wiser judgment we we're going to stop midway through to our destination and test and see how quiet this thing really is. Oh, okay. And we really only need three more Officers of the law. We only had three more cops. So hopefully we're going to find them and not find any bears. Plus it does have 90 in the in the mag. Or no, 60. I guess 60, excuse me. So that's pretty good. Oh, God, it's so good. Hmm, and we actually did already have a job. I forgot we grabbed one last episode. We just hadn't gone and done it yet. Excuse me, tiny man. Don't forget, we are in survivalist. I'm sure I said that before, but it's been a while. Old Johnny Town. <laughs> Makes me laugh every time. Paper. No, no, we're good. Uh, meh. I will take your free wood. Thank you. All right. Oh, big mama. How you doing? There's a bear. You're a regular bear. Goodbye, sir. Jerk. The damn parkour is so good. Um, let's send you off. Proper like. Um. He's a cop.
be two more that we need. <sighs> Hopefully we get them in this episode. So I can just be done with that. Oh, no, that's empty. Never mind. Oh, there's one more. How did you see me? Your awareness is amazing. They have better awareness than anybody. There you are. What? Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Done and doneer. Okay, you need to go here and here and there. Boom. Oh, that next turn in should be nice. Hopefully. We'll all find out. All right, let's get this quest done, guys. Oh, no. You ain't getting away from daddy. Revenge. Okay. Quest time. Here we go. I don't even know what it is. Uh, clear and retrieve. Oh. It's not going to go as fast as I want, but we don't have to loot except to the end, which makes it nice. Unless there's something that we just can't resist. I went the wrong way. Shit. Uh, stuff like this. It's like I've read them all. What? Something literally just stopped me right there. Oh, Jesus. Now we're just going to read these. Get rid of that. Oh, yeah, yeah, I know what this is. <laughs> right, right. Um, hmm. Okay. So about this, okay, there is the thing, uh. one of these is open. I know hell can break loose in here. I do know that. Especially if you go hog wild, which I have been known to do previously. It's just kind of my thing. Oh, God. You can also be careful. Which is not necessarily my strong suit. I'm more of a jump in and go crazy kind of guy. 
Um, TBF can definitely attest to that. Oh, you son of a... See? That's when you get your head chopped off. Jesus. Now these guys down here. Basically, this whole building is just a big death trap, but it's so fun to run after you get kind of used to how it goes. They drop through the ceiling up there, too, if you're not careful, FYI. <laughs> so if you're real sneaky, sneaky, you can, you can do really good things here. Excuse me, I did not want to cough in your ear. Uh, there's actually a really nice um, way to break a block outside that goes down to the basement. You can actually lure everybody from the basement outside that same block as well. It's really, really neat. <laughs> okay, that takes care of everybody there. Let's see, can we... I don't think this is going to work, but... Oh can break it though. Yes. Okay. Hello, baby. <laughs> it takes care of two, you suckers. Can you bring me that back? Oh, that's so nice of you. Oh, you didn't bring it back? You son of a bitch. Um, now you. Oh, feral thug. Looking all thuggy. It'd be really nice if we had like a, uh, I was looking for a mega crush, but that didn't work out. Okay, so everybody on the floor activated. Uh oh. Hello, fellas. That was mostly a twofer. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Uh. Hey, let's get our... Oh, okay, I was doing what he was doing. Didn't work out for either of us. Get our satchel so we don't forget. Now, did you see... Is there anything down there? I don't think there was. Nothing worth a darn anyway. There's books up there, though. What you doing? <laughs> uh, sure. Use that, use that. I don't need either one of those. Okay. Crapper John MD. Go up here. Oh, we gotta. Yeah. I don't think this is a trap here. Can't remember. No, just grab the books. I think there's a bit of ammo on the table over there. Grab the chairs. I'll take those, you know, actually I'll take all that because I'll use that ammo on Horde Knight. 
Okay. Make a level six ratchet. I don't really need to at this point. So the reason I grabbed these chairs, by the way, this is just free wood. And these chairs here, early game, especially for um, your new armor that you're making. A really good source of that leather that you need. And you need a ton of leather. So look at that. A stack of 10 chairs. 60 um, leather. Now, is it a better idea to scrap them standing where they are? Yes, because you get mechanical parts and such. I don't need the mechanical parts. I have tons of them. So I'm just picking them up and scrapping them in my inventory. Should you do it differently early game? Yes, you definitely should. Because especially with the... Uh, especially with the uh, achievement for uh, scrapping all the stuff. Achievements, the uh, challenges rather, excuse me. Hello. So much business, such little time. Attack rifle, quality one. To be fair, I'm not surprised. I'm surprised those guys aren't uh, radiated. That would go down. That goes up. Is this with the roof? It is. Okay. Um, This can get sketchy up here. What I'd like to do. Meant to do. I'm going to hit reload. Excuse me. Okay. So you come out. If you put ladders here, you just crawl right up on top of there and it's a whole lot safer. Oh boy. Now, it's not safer if you fall off, granted. Oh, shit. I activated all of them over there, too. Ha, <laughs> ha. All right, all right, all right. Well, let's do this. But I took care of the ones that were over on top of that. So it's less of them to deal with. Okay, let's mark our airdrop so I don't have to worry about forgetting where it went. Um, airdrop. Okay. Is that everybody? I think. Uh, sure. I think that was all of them. Now we just have to worry about the basement. Such good views. And this would lead you around, I think, and back in. Ugh. Coming up here. Yeah. 
Definitely a better way to do this, and I didn't do it that way. I shouldn't say better. There's a smarter way to do it, and I didn't do it that way. Yeah, you cook. I'm good with that. Let's go sneaky sneak up on him and scratch his back. Oh, oh, no, no, no. Nope. Sorry, Stumpy. Oh. Lord, I heard heavy breathing. I didn't know what was happening. BP. Good night. Okay. You make a wooden club quality six. Yeah. Go me. Would be the death trap that I just came out of. Okay. I think we're good. Yep. All right. Now, got the basement. Uh, the basement. Which is a rough time. So, I did this thing before. My buddy TBF. Is it a smart thing to do? I don't know, but it worked. Um, let's just see if we can do it again. Uh, no, that's not where you go. Hi. So what they're going to do is they're going to run and cycle and they're going to come around to that door that we came in initially. Yep, right up there. Well, they're going to try to anyway, but it's bulletproof glass. As soon as they break through, though, uh huh. Yeah, see. Oh, God.
You coming, bro? And there's the bookshelf. What the heck? I'm trying to get book smart. There you go, Steve. Good man. Okay, I think that's all of them down there. Let's go this way. Okay, now we have to worry about, I believe it's just this. Let's grab what we can off these before they get destroyed. Hold on two seconds. Before we call down the demon horde. <laughs> These bookshelves just they basically get destroyed right away. They did the last few times we did this though. We, we pretty much got worn out of this POI when we did this before. Like quickly. But we got so good at it, we could do it in like five minutes. Desert Vulture Quality 6. Yep, there they come. And that's a... Oh, God. That's a trigger room. Hmm. Oh, we might be able to get down there and clear it out. Nope. nope. If I'm on the ground, they know I'm there. I'm confused. Who's angry? And why? Oh, wait, is there, a, is there a horde outside? Oh, shit. Did we get a wandering horde at the same time? Come on. Game. <laughs> no. That would be real unfortunate timing. That would be real unfortunate timing. Dang it. There's a dog super close somewhere. No, I just think it's the angry shit downstairs. Damn it. Which is fine, you should be angry. Uh oh. <laughs> well, there's 
There's most of them. Have I told you how much I love this armor set? Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, that scared me so bad. <laughs> oh. Sorry about that shot in the nards. Oh. Ooh, money. Ooh, more money. Really? I guess some of them did get all the way outside. Damn. Oh, Jesus Christ. Fuck. Fucking mutts. See if we can clear these guys out. Machete and crossbow. Get this part done. Then we'll go clear out the street level. Ah. Uh. Another dog. Jesus. Here, I have I have something for you guys in that room. Come here, buddy. Hello, sir. And something for you guys in that room. Holy titties. Don't even feel bad. Come on. Oh, that was all of them. Oh, perfect. Good. All right, loot. It's going to be... I don't know, to be honest. I don't remember. Oh, it's back behind us. I know where it's at. Oh, no. I think I did get hoarded. Shit. Okay, hang on. Oh, yep, yep, yep. I definitely did.
I don't know that for sure. <laughs> All right, let's hop in here real quick. We're just not going to open that main door. Scrap the rest of our chairs here. Scrap, scrap, scrap. Uh oh. Come on, lockpick. Do me good. Oh my god. The one shot. Eh. Nice. Dark trap bundle. Okay. Tack rifle. I just, I don't like the tack rifles. I really don't. Just do not. Not a huge fan. Uh, definitely not worth the cost of admission. Let's just hop on the bike. <laughs> All right. Hello, bear. Oh, yeah. There are a lot of angry things out here that, not, that did not like me making noise. All right. Let's get back to the trader. We'll turn that in and we'll uh, probably have to call that good there. Those things just take so long to do, unfortunately. So I will see you here in just a minute. Traverse these dangerous alleyways. All right, see you over there. All right, coming up here. Chop all of our extra junk off here. Um, things not needed right now. Um, okay. all this in here yeah, we'll keep that to sell probably and we'll probably sell that sell that so that Ooh, sell that, sell that. To be fair, we'll just sell all these because we don't have time to set anything up Horde Night-wise and add it into the base. I mean, we just don't. So. Trader's back here. Where are you going, bro? Oh, God. If anything I'd add anyway, it would be, uh... Um, electric fence. And to be honest, they, they don't sit there long enough to worry about it, so. Welcome back, my friend. Fantastic. Hello, sir. Job done. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think I'd rather just have the gas cans to make more Olotovs. Oh. Oh, Cop Slayer. Okay. So this is the cop turn in to kill the cops. Get a water filter. Oh, so that'll just straight give me... Just straight gives you regular water. Oh, our crucible or four legendary parts. Oh, so that gives you instantly gives you level six or whatever. You also get a crucible. That's pretty cool. Solar cell is also a good get. Man. I mean, I don't need a crucible because I already have one. I've made one at this point. I don't need the legendary parts. I think I kind of want to just get a water filter to see if that actually just gives you straight clean water out of your thing. I want to test that. I don't need another crucible, unfortunately, but it's nice to know that you get that. Okay. Okay. 
Sell, sell, sell. Very good to know that that's what that does. I mean, you weren't supposed to know about that. To be fair. No, nine mil. Well, that's unfortunate. Okay. Um, spend no money guarantee. We don't just sell armor, we sell peace of mind. Spend it no money guarantee? Joel, that's fucked up. Um luxury fence post. I mean I I, I mm. There's a solar bank. Just showed up. I don't think it was there before. I don't think. Well, anyways. Smart, then there's dead. <laughs> it's fucked up. All right, we're going to call that good there, guys. I will see you in the next one. Then I'm going to head back to base and pop this in there. And uh, how close are we job-wise? 30 away. I don't think we're going to make it. I can try to work on some off-camera. <laughs> I don't know if we'll end up being done with tier five or not. I, guess, I have another episode before Hornet, I guess. I guess today, tomorrow, uh, we could try. Uh, but yeah, we'll see you next time. Thanks so much. Bye-bye.